last few videos uh, we have been looking at negation and we've seen maybe three or four different rules that are applied uh, in terms of negation like we've seen how to negate an affirmative sentence or a statement um, and we have also seen yeah so to make a sentence negative place the word no before the verb right and 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 in terms of responding to a question in a negative way uh, we can use double negatives or two negatives required so no no is just answering a question no and then giving some context to it and that no would uh, precede the verb right uh, so so we have seen that and we have just gone through this uh, opposites, antonyms, counterparts, right? Algo nada, algo en nadi, nadi, um, nadi. Uh, let's see, let's just confirm that pronunciation in just a second. Things should be nadi. Nadie. Yeah, nadie. Alright, so nadie. Algo, ningún, siempre, nunca. Um, this. Alright, let's check how this is pronounced. Hamas. 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 Alright. Okay. También, tampoco. Um, and the negative words can also be used alone. Preceding the verb. Nadie habla, el, el nunca come. Alfredo tampoco baila. Right, and and here this we also seen this. Um, the negative words can also be used with the word no following the verb. Uh, double double negatives are acceptable. Uh, so we've seen that, and now let's look at how three uh, negative words occur in the same uh, sentence. So, no compro nada nunca. So, no is one, nada is two, uh, nunca is three, three negative words, right? So, I never buy anything. Él no compra nada tampoco. He doesn't buy anything either. So, that's interesting. Uh, you can even have four negative words in the same sentence. Yo no veo nunca a nadie tampoco. I never see anybody either. So, um, so you can, you can see, I mean, you, you, so two is the minimum, right, from what you've seen. Um, then you can use three and then, and you can even have four if you want to. Um, all right. So I think that is enough for this video. Um, and just to recap, so we've seen how to use a, a where our examples where uh, three negative and and four uh, negative words can be used right so you see nadie nunca no uh, tampoco is also uh, a negative word right and uh, and here you can see no nunca nadie tampoco we used four negative words right so um, all right so in the next video we will um, look at how we look at this section right so until then see you next time